is up, Apex Nation. Welcome back to some more Resident Evil 3, 3, 3, 3. Hope you guys are having a great today. If you guys are enjoying this series and you love watching, you want to see more because you're going to see more, hit that thumbs up button to show your support. All right, so we have the uh, bolt cutter now. We just got we're good on ammo, kind of. We're actually doing actually pretty well on ammo. We're going to leave that alone. And we're going to go back and explore the places we couldn't explore before because we didn't have the bolt cutter. Are you all still going to stay there? We're going to avoid there. Okay, so... Bolt cutter there. This was a lockpick, was it not? For the toy toy uncle? Okay, cool. So we can go to the supermarket with a bolt cutter. So we will. Hey! I don't remember what was in here. Fancy box. I'm gonna clear enemies first before we explore. Although I think we're good on enemies. Ooh, a first aid spray. A high grade gunpowder. I have three exact inventory slots, right? So we have everything we can grab here. So gunpowder. A first aid spray, which is awesome. First time we got one of those. Brings you to full health. And a fancy box, which will probably have a jewel in it, right? I imagine. We'll take a look at that right now. Yep. Another one of those jewels, which we don't know what they do yet. And you're cleared out. Now, I want to go back this way. So far, Nemesis isn't a problem. And also, I'm pretty amazed how well play the, playing this game on uh, mouse and keyboard is. There was nothing here, was there? No, there was nothing there. Usually, I don't play these type of games with mouse and keyboard. I've mentioned that before. This is the first time I am actually am. And it's not bad. Store this, store this, store this. We have the bolt cutter, so we can go get the shotgun today. Wrong side. It was over here. No, that was a lockpick. Crap. Not a bolt cutter. I thought that was a bolt cutter. That's the reason why I came back this way. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We definitely want to go back to the donut shop, but we're going to go the long way to the donut shop because I am not trusting the fact that Nemesis may or may not appear there if I go the short way. What was that? What? There's been ammo there the entire time? I did not know that. Uh, okay, good. Ammo stack's higher than 50. I was a little bit worried about that. The demo, that triggers Nemesis, so we're avoiding that right now. And actually going this way will give us a shotgun. Keep my ears peeled, but I don't think there's anything around here. What was that? There's a ladder over there. I can't reach that ladder. Gotcha. Avoid in there. At all cost. <laughs> I don't trust that Nemesis won't be there. I took, I took care of my grenade. I don't have that on me anymore. Uh, you're still fine? You're still fine. I do want to keep her, you know, as healthy as I can. I killed you already. Just making sure there's going to be no one over there. So some zombies are popping back up. Or the ones I haven't killed yet. Uh, pharmacy didn't have... My man has something locked. Or a bolt cutter. We can take a look. No, no. Pharmacy did not. Pharmacy just had the code. Nothing locked in here. That was just a box on that side. Inside the railway, though, is the shotgun. We know this. Now, I 
still... I didn't kill you. Oh, I think he comes back with the... Spoiler alert, but I think he comes back with the shotgun. He's like your first enemy to kill with a shotgun. That's a lockpick. There wasn't a locker in here? No, okay. Can't wait to get that lockpick. I'm hoping the lockpick's just like an item you'll have, not an item you have to carry with you. Well, I mean, like, not an item that goes up here. It was just something she can slip in a pocket, because, I mean, it really shouldn't be an item that goes in there. There's a lot less things to bolt cut than I thought there were. But the bolt cutter still has another use. It hasn't gone to the trash can symbol yet. You know what? For fun. Because I think you will pop up now because I have it. Oh. oh. Okay. So this is the reticle. Making sure. Now we do have the shock, and I love how she has it on her back, too. We have the shotgun worries me a little bit. Is that bolt cutter? That's a bolt cutter. Okay. It worries me a little bit that I'm going to trigger Nemesis now. I can't remember what triggers Nemesis. Oh, that's not even a bolt cutter? I thought that was a bolt cutter thing as well. Why am I coming back here? I kind of want to carry... Oh, actually, that will go up there. Ammo down here. I need more room. I have two slots left. I do want to carry the shotgun on me, just in case. Don't have a lot of ammo for it, but I do want to carry it on me, so that was a waste. I also thought there was a bolt cutter thing in there, but there was not. There's a bolt cutter thing here. And there's one back at the place we just were, where we started the episode at. You gotta be kidding me. I was backing up and everything. We have a barrel there that. Ooh, how hard are you? Caution. Yoohoo! Can I get all three? Or did I get you? Oh, I did get you. Awesome. Handgun ammo is really helpful. Another hand grenade is not. Okay, one slot left. Shotgun shells. It's helpful. Inventory is looking good. Put that one in there. Okay. Let's go put away the hand grenade and the shotgun shells. I'm just going to keep that loaded at any two slots in there. I have a first aid spray. I have those. I think I'm going to use another green. I think I'll get more green as we go. I just want to get back to fine. I'm not sure if Nemesis Boy comes out or not. I'm still not going that way. I refuse. You can't make me. I will go this way. We were just in subway control room. We were just in the pharmacy. We checked everywhere. That needs a lockpick. That needs a lockpick. And there, no, that actually that has the bolt cutter in there. That needs a lockpick. And it has a puzzle. Okay. Just trying to remember everything we are doing. I should be good just to run through all this. No one should pop up. It's 
sounded like Nemesis running after me. Which is scary. And I really do think this is the way to go. This helps you stop Nemesis from popping up. Unless it's not like the demo. I don't know. But over here. Now we can open this. And this might be the last thing for the book cutters. Yeah, discarding items. So we can just get rid of this. Discard. Can you be see us? Yeah, careful, careful. Come on, don't look at me like that, all right? I'm not an infected. No, 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 wait, please! What the fuck? Mm -hmm. He was infected. He might have been infected. Oh, stars dissolved. No wonder so many of you dead. And what are you, UBCS, killing your own people? He would have turned. There's your sense of self-preservation. Go back to the subway station. We don't need a bleeding heart like you getting in the way. What a jerk. Oh, well, so, uh, oh man. He, I think he was uh, Natsu from Fairy Tale. Training log. July 10th, 202 pounds, 12 laps of the yard, two circuits. Suck it, prison. <laughs> the Umbrella Corporation just recruited me for a job. A job! Don't know how they're going to whip a out, whip out a life sentence for murdering 20 gangbangers. But whatever, I'll take it. Beats pooping away the rest of my life behind bars. Gotta get back in shape. Okay. Target practice at 400 yard, five misses. Caught the chain yesterday and got moved to a UBCS training camp where I fired my first bullet in two whole years. Missed a stationary target by five inches at 400 yards. I never do that. It's like I forgot everything. Doesn't matter. I'll get in shape again. Watch me. Two misses. Okay. I get my shot grouping down to three inches. Feeling good. Pretty good. After lunch, they put me through my first mock battle. The cap and the other guys are good people. But god dang. Beast of war at that. And what is up with luna that lunatic Nicolia? He used me as a human shield just to score some extra points. Murphy's back, baby. Oh, no misses. You'll never see me miss another target. Tomorrow I'll go to my first mission. Riot control at Raccoon City. I think Jimmy would have liked that. My brother was always the first to reach out and help people. Right up until the street punks took him away from me. Now it's my turn to do some good for a change. The way I know best. Oh, so the street punks took your brother. You killed them all. How many did you kill? 20. And now you get the opportunity to do good. And now you're dead. Well, life goes on, right? Life always finds a way. We'll move forward with shotgun shells on us. Why not? I don't want to talk to that dude. I don't like Nicola. He seems like a jerk. And the first chance I get, I will put a bullet in him. I will not hesitate. Ain't got ammo? Suicide note. September 28th. The Middle East. Eastern Europe. East Africa. I thought I knew what hell was. I figured I'd never crack no matter what was thrown at me. But this job. This one was supposed to be easy. A quick wage. I'd earn it. It all happened at once. There are 30 guys in our squad. All armed with state-of-the-art assault rifles. And yet, we were wiped out in less than 48 hours. Dang. I've been through enough poop. To know it, never it, it, know it only gets worse. And if it, if that wasn't just the beginning, maybe I'm a coward. I don't care. This is the only way I the only way I have left. I just hope my body doesn't get back up after I pull the trigger. Nope, it hasn't. Oh, I'm worried. Something's gonna happen. Is you twitching? I thought you were twitching. Man, I'm loving this game so much. I can't 
can't stop playing. I'm probably gonna play it for the rest of the day. I'm gonna have so many videos recorded. <laughs> Electricians, no. Public use generator provided by Reckon City Electricians Guild Guide. Due to the outgo ongoing power outages, the gu guide, guild, 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 has decided to provisionally place a number of electric generators throughout the city. Everyone is welcome to use them, but remember, these generators are running high voltage current. If we were, uh, if, if one were to be stuck in a impacted or impacted by gunfire, everyone in standard would be electrocuted. Can't right now. You got that? If you see a generator spinning sparks, don't go near it. Don't do anything, stupid. Safety first, as the saying goes. If we make it through this mess, I'll have plenty of busted generators for sale at bargain price. You're a neighborhood electrician, Sam. Yeah, we knew that. We've done that before. But you're teaching me that now to do it with that one? Oh, two for one deal. Yes. All right, thank you for that generator knowledge because that was helpful because dogs suck. But, oh man, I love this having this scope. It makes aiming so much better. All right, y'all stay on that side of the fence. Yeah, have well, a good deal. You enjoy your cars. I mean, I don't know how you can enjoy that, but enjoy it. I don't want you all. Eh, that might not break down because I can't exactly explore that. You know, it's not showing me like this is an area I can explore, so that gate should hold, otherwise I'd be able to go back there. Or, if that does break down and this all of a sudden comes open, that's a really good idea of Capcom to do that, thinking people are going to assume things based on the map. Like me. Although I don't trust doors anymore. Another cop has fallen out of one. And also, this is way too quiet of an area. Granted, Nikola just came through here. Nikolai. I'm, I'm assuming that's Nikolai. Judging by that note we read. Is that my first gunpowder? Yeah. Okay. I uh, would like a safe house to put that away in. Litter me with safe houses. Okay, we're good. Let's move on. Nope. Stop running. Stop running, Jill. Or give me another gunpowder, if you would. Be so kind. Or a high. I'll make more shotgun shells. Didn't Nicola come through here? Shoot, shoot, shoot. Are you dead? in your hand okay I was a little worried I preemptively used my shotgun there I probably didn't have to okay that's locking that door I'm hitting the wrong buttons gunpowder did I wait I uh, don't know I'd rather wait if I could how much gun do I if I see another thing to pick up I will use other than that, I will try to save it to the next. Everything reloaded? Yeah. Save it to the next safe room. Oh, I hit the wrong way. My bad. And of course, we find a red one. Is that a safe room in there? That might be a typewriter. But yeah, of course we find a red. We're, uh, I'll leave that red there for right now. This might be a safe room. It is. Awesome. Beautiful. <gasps> What are you? A hip pouch? Oh my god, that's beautiful. Get organized. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna store this. Store this. I have some shotgun shells. We'll take those out. Now that we can actually hold ammo down here. Perfect. Four slots for stuff. Beautiful. You're gorgeous. Come back through here. Let's go grab this real quick. I'm a hoarder. Leave me alone. Plop you in the storage. Facts from Substation Chief. To all employees, in response to the violent outbreak across the city, 
We have implemented an international power outage. Since the situation has been brought under control, please activate the four breakers ASAP. Once that's done, turn on the main power switch in the control room to reactivate the power grid. Activate the four breakers as soon as possible and done that main power switch. Okay, got it. Drop a save real quick. Oh, I thought that was a dude. Okay, I like that we have a safe room. We're looking good on inventory. We got actual ammo on us now. And I like my setup so far because I can just quickly go up to go to that, down to go there, down to go to there, up to go back there. Once I get a fourth gun, though, or a fourth thing in there, that might be a little annoying. Oh. What is this? Oh, God. It smells like... Oh, I don't even want to think about it. Yeah. Well, you should, Jill, because uh, you should be questioning, what is all this? Are we going to have some liquors come down at us or something? Hunters, maybe? Two greens, really? You're going to make me go back. I'm going to! Uh, green Arabs, they work. I was starting to look like Chad was never going to come back from his rounds. So I poked my head in there, and oh, the next thing I know, I got some kind of maggot squirming down my throat. I was gagging and heaving. Those little jerks didn't even seem to mind none. They just wouldn't come up. I was strugg struggling around like a madman when I saw it. A green herb. My grandma once told me that green herbs are natural bug deterrent. So I grabbed one, shoved it down my gob, and swallowed. And what do you know? The little thing didn't want to be up there in there anymore. I've never been so happy to throw up. I'm going to head back there and look for Chad. If anyone sees this, remember, eat your greens. Well, I'll keep one on me, but I'm going to assume I'm good enough so I don't have the two on me. That's my assumption. But inventory space is mine. I'll keep one on me. You convinced me. Nope. Keep one on me. And also maggots are going to be jumping down my throat. Nah. It's not good. Padlock. Oh. What are you? Substation internal memo. The key to the high voltage area has gone missing. And the easiest, earliest, we've been able to get a replacement is next week. So the intern, so in the interim, a lockpick will be provided to the senior employee on duty. We only have one lockpick. It can't afford to lose it. So please keep it in its carrying case at all times when you're not using it. It's a lockpick. And please, could you all check just once more that you did not accidentally take the key home? you happen to find it, please bring it to Kate in admin and you lose your job. Are you dead? Is that the lockpick? If that's a lockpick, I'm turning around and doing a bunch of other stuff. God. Why do I feel like maggots are about to pop out? We're about to fight our first maggots. Hey, this is this is creepy stuff, man. Hey, you dead? Good. And I have my hand. I have my knife out, which is not smart. I should have clicked on this when I had my handgun out. Oh, what are those? Okay, I got a case. Congrats. Oh my god. Get over here. I get options. Especially when it comes to cool substance. Oh, okay. uh, looks special made some some kind of tool or something inside. <laughs> it's a rusted lockpick that was inside there. Awesome. Um, I'm gonna assume it's not one-time use, and we're going back. This will happen a lot in this game. Once I get a new item to use, I'm going back and using it in all the spots I could. Why would you not? Now, because I'm not going through that area anymore, I'm going to put this away. Gives me three inventory slots to mess around with. And let's go. Let's go play with the lockpick. Hopefully it's kind of a mini game. Although I kind of hope it's not at the same time. Hope it's just a use. Also, these zombies just disappeared on us. 
Don't know how I feel about this. Yeah, it's just gonna be a use. That's fine. I'm perfectly okay with that. The bolt cutter wasn't a mini game, so I don't know why I expected that to be a mini game. Oh no! They stack in 60. I'm right here. I mean, why not just go throw that little bit of ammo away? Or put it away, I should say, not throw it away. Just so I can have three more spots left open. And now we continue on. There's so much to explore now. And that's the fun of Resident Evil games. Is you get to, like, you get something to unlock new areas in the map for you to go. And also, I should slow down to not run through doors anymore. Because we're not entirely sure we'll be safe. That music is ominous as well. And I don't care if I would have to come back here anyway later on in the story. To, then I could have a chance to do all that. I want to do it now. There's nothing over there to lockpick. Mainly because I remember everything yeah. that needs to be lockpicked right now. I don't like the music though. Music is telling me bad things are going to happen. Ooh, a first aid spray. Very nice. Oh, I hate that music. Okay, so I think I'm gonna go up this way, back around here. The pharmacy had nothing, subway control had something. There was nothing there. Donut shop had something. I'm going back around after that. They're going down here to that one. I still refuse to enter this courtyard. Oh yeah, there's even a... Shut up. There's even a door over there we can go into now. But first we'll go this way. I'm going to assume there's nothing that's going to jump out at me. These zombies didn't disappear. Why'd the other ones disappear? Excuse you? Who made a ting? Someone ting. I refuse. That courtyard the courtyard has trained me to never go into it again. Can you imagine if that's what triggers Nemesis and if you never went to it again? Nemesis would never be in the game. How interesting would that be? I mean, it's that's not what's gonna happen. But how interesting would that be? We know the pharmacy has nothing. The railway station did have something. And granted, you would have to come back here because you have to go inside the subway station to get it running. But like I said, I'm doing it now. Yeah. I want this. And it might be something to help me out. I mean, I guess. Oh, okay, you stack more than 10. Uh, that one's probably going to stack to like 20 or something. That one I imagine is going to be a small stack number. You're still dead? Good. Uh, I refuse. I was like, should I actually just try to go inside that area? No, I refuse. I refuse to go in there. Good thing is, we've only come across one spot so far that has had a lot of frames missing. Hopefully it doesn't happen during a high stakes area. Alright, we have one more thing we can go pick lock and it's going to take us a little bit to get back there. It would be shorter if I trusted that path, which I don't. I do not. I should have saved it and tried it. I should have. That's my bad. I should have saved it and tried it. But we're already this far. So we're going this way. Oh, we actually know. We have a, another area to go to. We have that entire store to go explore. Along with that safe room. We'll go in that safe room first. Actually, no. Ooh, don't go there. We'll go into the store first. The store's probably going to have a bunch of stuff. When we go to the safe room after, that makes more sense. Do, 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 
I do like how I don't have to use a button to go into ladders and jump through windows and stuff. It just auto does it as you go towards it. That is nice. Open you. Okay, there's nothing. You're Charlie doll. The original Charlie doll was based on the likeness of toy uncle founder Charlie McBurgan and has become the mascot of the company. We are pleased to present the porcelain Charlie doll to celebrate its 25th anniversary. Individually crafted with love and care by our staff, this limited edition item makes for a precious gift. We hope you find his place or a cherished member of your family. Caution, this project is extremely fragile. Please do not drop it or strike it. Well, this is a place we had to go to get that, but this door is a lot smaller than I thought. Also, it would have been a cool Easter egg to put on some of this stuff for Mega Man. Let's examine this, open this up for a third jewel. Interesting, that's definitely gonna be a thing, which we're already collecting, so that's kinda cool. That was everything in there, yep. And let's get our last, uh, again, we'd have to come back through here anyway, because of, it's a subway station, we're supposed to go here once we restore power. But I don't want to, I want to do it now. I want to wait. Because I have a feeling I'm going to be chased and bad things are going to happen around here. Do I have inventory space? Yeah, I do. So why not have all these resources now so when we're getting chased through here, we don't have to stop. And, okay, 16. Put that away. Oh, man, we are at time. Dang. Well, we got the lockpick. And yeah, next episode we go back, <laughs> back into here. Oh yeah, the power subway station. Yeah, the next episode we go try to restore power. Then we got to go to the control room, and then we got to go back there. Yeah, we're getting there. We went exploring. I was hoping to find more gun mods. That's what I was really hoping for by going back and opening up all that stuff, but we didn't. But I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. And if you did, hit that thumbs up button and try to show your support words. <laughs> uh, feel free to share this. Uh, if you're new and you haven't subscribed for more content, feel free to share this video and comment down below. And until next time, I'm Apex Reaper. You all stay positive. Thanks for watching. Afraid of the dark? Are you scared?